Local states are suitable for those widgets that depend on a single value, like a switch, toggles, or checkboxes. By this time, you know that using set state is highly discouraged. And when your team decides to violate that rule for smaller widgets for any logical reason, well, you can have crisp and smaller code yet achieve similar functionality using two more widgets. Using value builder, you can specify a type like bool, give an initial value of true or false. In the builder, provide switch widget. The value parameter is the one which holds the bool value, and just keep the on change function to execute the update function. The update function just toggles the value. When you run it, because value builder rebuilds the widget when value changes, so the switch will toggle. While this looks good, this is simple state management. So let's see how we can achieve same with reactive way using getx. And you know, with reactive style, the code becomes even more sleek because there is no need for callbacks. To get reactive style, use obx value with rx bold type. Remember rx counterparts of primitive types? This is same. In the switch widget, get the value from rx variable, and in the on changed, pass in the rx variable. This will simply update the rx variable with the latest value. The second variable is the initial data, that is false, but with a twist. It is a rx type of boolean. And that's it. You have reached the end of this video and I am sure you will like this ease of managing local states. So leave your feedback in the comments and show some love by hitting the like button and sharing this video in various filter forums. And if you are new to this channel, support me and the channel by subscribing this. And thanks for watching. See you in the next one.